Hello there everybody, it's Mark Watson here. I'm just doing a short reply I had something I've read on the internet. Um, it's in relation to uh, gymnastics. Um, those of you that follow it, as do I, it's in relation to the e, um, World Championships in um, 2011 um, Tokyo. It was won by um, just in Weber and uh, Se Second was um, Victoria Kamova of uh, Russia. Um, Weber won it by a difference of uh, 0.033. Um, and um, to be honest, um, I mean, I, although I'm a fan of Kamova, um, I think that. that um, that Weber was a worthy winner, to be fair. I mean, I, I was disappointed for, for um, Victoria, but that's the way things go in the sport. The um, thing is, um, I read something um, today. Hey, um, I can't remember the website off her, um, but I'll put a link to it after I post this video. Um, the person that um, had written the blog, it was a blog, was um saying about um Beaker's reaction. Um I don't mean to be rude, but that there were multiple inaccuracies with it. I mean when Vika came off from finishing her floor routine, I will not I will quite openly admit that I thought my I said how that she'd done it. I thought that she'd nailed it. And you could see from the look, look in her face when she rounded off from on the floor routine that she thought she, it, it was in with a chance. Um, she came off from the, the floor mat, was congratulated by her coach. And uh, this is where the first point of note comes in. The poster of the blog said that when Vika walked past Weber. She didn't even acknowledge her and just briefly knocked, um, she went like that, ah, not knuckles with her. Um, that's not, not right. If you watch it again, albeit it's very, very quick, they shake hands. Um, so that point is inaccurate. And the um, second point I'd like to make, make is that he, they were criticising, the blogger was criticising Vika's reaction. Because when the scores go up, you can see in her, her face, Vika this is, the score horse come up and she put, puts her hands over her mouth. She goes... Like that, and again, the the poster was cri was criticizing her further. That I mean, that says to me no, nothing other that Vika was um shocked at the score. Um, and um, the block. Hogger okay, then proceeded to own again at Vika because she cried. I mean, she's disappointed. Of course she's going to... Of course... Um, of course she's going to have... Of course... I mean, of, of course she's going to have... Of course she's going to have a little cry. And I mean, what the poster's forgetting is that Weber cried as well. Weber cried because she was relieved and... Come over, you could see he from her her body language was crying because she was upset that that she'd scored second, but it was a very worthy second. I mean, you can see from her body language that she's absolutely devastated, but that's the way a life goes. Um, thirdly, the poster said um, about her not even ignore. Acknowledging um, Weber. Uh, that's not entirely true. 
I mean, don't get me wrong. When they walk out, Vika walks straight past Weber. Doesn't it? Doesn't even look, look at it. And although I do not, although I do not um, condone that, you know, it's just. Um, was it inappropriate of her? Possibly, yes. But again. She was disappointed. She probably didn't feel in the mood for it at the time. And also, the posters said that she walked straight out of the arena. Come over. That's not true. Watch the video of her exiting. She still hops with two other gymnasts for a picture. And the last point I'm going to make in relation to the actual presentation is that when... Uh, Kavorva got her medal. She went up onto the podium after she aching the her place. Ha and I can't remember. Um, I can't. I can't remember the third place gymnast name. Um, it was a Chinese girl. I think she was called. I think she was called. Called, um Yu Ying or something. I mean, she takes her place on the podium, and then Weber wa walks past, and again the poster was criticizing Kamorva. Kamorva does not ignore her. She shakes her ha ha hand and kisses this is her. I mean, don't get me wrong, her reaction afterwards was a little bit inappropriate. Um, stand um, stand in the way uh, that she did it, making faces during the American national anthem. Um, also pulling her medal off. I mean, I will say to Vika that I mean, I appreciate she was disappointed, but that was a little bit immature of her. She should have been proud. I mean, to come second in a world championship is a major achievement, and you only just lost out on on gold. Point naught three three. Vika should have been proud. And also, oh, the la the I'm going to make two more points. When she was interviewed for Inside Gymnast magazine, she is specifically asked by one of the journalists, "Did you think that you'd won?" And she he straight away, "No, oh, I came second, and that's that." My, my goal now is to prepare for London. I mean, I think she took, took it in good, good faith, and I'm sure, or no doubt, after the competition, that uh, she was on good speaking to um, with, with um, Weber. I mean, people about ba saying that she should have won it, I mean, she potentially made, um, I think, two deciding errors. Firstly, if you look, Look at the double spin that she makes. She, she doesn't execute it properly. She does the spin. She's she's holding her leg up and and she drops it down sharply. Now, in gymnastics terminology, that is a fall. A fall in gymnastics doesn't necessarily mean fall as we you know it, as in you fall to the ground. In gymnastics, doing what she did can be classified as a fall. Also, if you look at her last tumble where she lands, she she goes first with her chest down, and you can get penalised for that as well. I mean, it wasn't faultless because I mean Weber put her her foot out of the floor, and I've seen competitions where um, people have been deducted. It point three hundredths for putting their foot out. You know, I, I mean, was I high disappointed that Kamorva did that Kamorva didn't win it? Of course, of course I was, because I wanted her to win. But I think that some of the comments coming her way about her being unsporting are a little unfair. I mean, you win some, you lose some. It's the same with all sports. 
I mean, all I will say is that she, it will definitely be one for the future. And, I mean, at the end of the day, Weber won it. Congratulations to her. That's that. Even Vika herself admitted it. So, I mean, I think that uh, she, Vika, was just showing her, her emotions. I mean, we um, can't a, a judge for her. I mean, in what she did, it, it could possibly be acceptable in her culture. I don't know. I don't know for sure. But I mean, I just think that some of the uh, criticism played it was a little unfair. I mean, that's all I'm going to say on the matter. If anyone wants to comment underneath, you're welcome. All I ask is that you be respectful, of course. Um, and in the meantime, take care uh, and look after yourselves.